looking at a guy that will contend for a championship. And if our fighter meeting on Thursday is any indication, confidence, not an issue for this young man coming in here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. <laughs> Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Assassin! And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 14 wins, four losses. He stands five feet ten inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Busan, South Korea, the Korean Superboy, Do Ho Choi. All right, commit the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back to your corners, come fight. a big time fight. It feels like a big moment for both of these guys' careers. Who is going to be able to implement their game plan the best in this matchup between these two big time athletes? Oh, that's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. It has to. This guy has landed his kick with so much force. Ooh, what a punch. And they separate. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Watch these to the body. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Right hand punch in the clinch. Fighters engaging in the clinch here early. And now he's got that tie clinch. Oh, nice job with the knee strike there. That'll wake you up. He thought it would be available. He just knew he had to find the right time to throw it back the right time. Oh, nice job to land the straight punch there. Must be nice to have that kind of reach advantage, DC. I know you can't necessarily relate. Nice punch there by the Korean Super Bowl. Just out of range with that right hook. Nice hook there by the Korean Super Bowl. Lands a glancing right hand upstairs. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. Let's take it to go to the head. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. And there comes the separation now. Left hand punch to the clinch. Getting the hands going here early. Straight punch lands. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Got the single collar tie. Counters now left hook to the head lands. Right punch is there. All right, so once again, they will clinch, and we will see which fighter is able to advance their position from here. Who's going to be the first one to attempt the takedown? Both of our combatants have the ability to score and secure the position. Who's going to be the one that makes the first move? Choi's strike attempt there is blocked. A big leg kick land. Oh, single collar tie here. It's just a slip there. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over again. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. 
stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? Nice loop and punch. What a tricky head kick. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Joy gets touched by that kick there. Oh, right hook attempt. No good. It's the elbow there. Back and forth we go. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. All right, single collar tie now. Oh, beautiful execution with the knee strike there. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. What do you follow up? A beautiful strike by Zach Beaglet. You'll see very short. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Well, really using his reach advantage there with that punch, DC. And he landed the right hand there. Well, we'll see if he can turn this defense into offense, but he's doing a great job blocking shots here tonight. As of right now, he's thinking more defensively, and he's doing a great job of not taking any damage. Nice strike. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. So he counters with an effective punch there, and at least in that situation, it paid to have the advantage in reach. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last one. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, next round is underway, and what a great job defensively in the previous round. I think my face from last night's dinner is more swollen than his opponent's. I mean, he did a fantastic job of seeing when his opponent was trying to attack and getting his guard up so that he's not taking damage to the face. Great defensive fight IQ shown by this fighter. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one? Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Oh, doubling up now, tripling up on that knee. He blocks the punch. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may throw the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. And he lands the knee to the body now. Right hand punches. And both guys really throwing with authority. Big Paul punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Big body kick land. Oh, collar tie. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. Just over three minutes to go in round two. All right, he closes the distance, gets the single collar tie. Nice punch, win. Just missed with the left there. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. Another punch to the head. He's really turning 
every part of himself into those strikes to the head. Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. Good punch lands. Stuffs the takedown, no problem. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Choice right torso started to bruise pretty good here. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Big punch land. Ooh. Ooh, blocks the shot. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. The Korean Superboy gets touched by that kick right to the body there. Nicely done by the opponent. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, that punch will count. Landed flush. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Yeah, he's mixing it all up. Overhand attempt now, it's blocked by Choi. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Right hand punch the clinch. How good is that right hand? Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Dig and kick. 20 seconds left. Well placed knee to the body. Ten seconds remain in round two. Single collar tie there. All right, round three coming up next. All right, let us look back at some of the action from that previous round. DC punches in bunches. I mean, over and over, he landed that big punch. And every time he landed it, he got the reaction that he was looking for. His opponent really did start to take notice every time he was loading that strike up. All right, here we go with our next round. A lot Ready? to be happy about in that Ready? previous round. He was attacking the head at will, and until his opponent adjusts, might as well go back to it. There was no negative to him headhunting. Most times the coaches yell, don't headhunt, don't headhunt. I'm yelling headhunt if right. I'm his corner, right. because every time he's thrown, he's landing. That kick blocked by Choi. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Connects with a right. It's a big hook. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. Oh, that's a nice strike. The right hand just misses. Single collar tie now. Choi's strike there is blocked. Nice job by the defense. Real nice body kick land. Stuff to take down, no problem. Straight right hand now, just misses. And they set. Great punch. All right, he engages in a single collar tie here. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. 
Throws the right hand there. Beautiful kick. His opponent got him in the clinch. He needs to break away and get back to his range because he's taking punch after punch from his clinch position. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Nice head kick. It's such a fast leg kick. And now they are throwing both sides with conviction. lands and it seemed like almost every strike found the target. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Well, not sure if he's lighter on his feet or what it is, but these last couple of rounds, he's been far more aggressive, a lot more pressure. Oh, he's really starting to light him up now. Body kick is blocked. Got the single collar tie. Again. Back into this position. Out of range with that one. He's got still attached to his body. The last time I saw a fight like that, it was Overeem versus Ngannou. And you know they still haven't found Alex Overeem's head. Big punch from the clinch. Oh, spinning back fist lands. Looked like a good knee to the body, but it's blocked. Beautiful punch. Oh, nice knee to the body for him there. Very nice. Look at him yank the head and land that beautiful punch to the clinch. Liver kick. Another one. Yep. Oh, and the left hand. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Oh, nice job by him there to slip that offer. Just out of range with that right hand. this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, he comes right back to his face. All right, let's check out some of the action, DC, and how about the punching acumen by that fighter in that previous round? He does not waste anything. He does not loop punches. Everything's tight. Everything's precise. He's a sniper. We always talk about how he's a sniper. He is a sniper, and it showed in that exchange that allowed him to drop his opponent. All right, the action continues here and now as our next ready? round gets underway. The previous rounds got the first grade round of the year, but pretty good action. It was a pretty good round. Not every round is going to have you standing up out of your seat. You understand that you are watching the highest level of fighting in the entire world in the UFC. <laughs> Trying to kick the leg out. Oh, nice knee to the head for him there. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes and a good solid. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, he might be out. Well, he misses with the left punch there. Oh, nice slip there. Great head movement overall by this guy defensively tonight. He does a great job of moving his head side to side, and really mixing up the motion at which he moves. Takedown defense holds up.
and they separate. Beautiful strike. Oh man, that left side is getting beat up now. Look at the redness there. Well, eventually you know he's gonna turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end thus far. They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now, oh man, as effective as straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got him hurt very bad. And a miss with the right hook. We march on three minutes to go. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Punch coming, it's blocked. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Big head kick lands. Oh, that kick is good by the Korean Super Bowl. Oh, single collar tie here. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Slips. Clipped him with the right hand there. Big kick lands. Joy gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Oh, big punch lands. Several failed attempts. He finally gets his first takedown. Now let's see what he can do with it. Big punch lands through the middle. Just missed with that right hand. And they separate. Nice kick. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Well, what got through, that kick was blocked. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Ooh, what a punch. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, he eats a knee there, that does not taste good. One, two there by Choi. Thirty seconds to go in the round. Big kick land. Tried to go to the body, but unable to connect. Punch over the top. Signifying the end of the round. We had a knockdown there, but not a knockout. No, it wasn't a knockout, but you can't take those shots. That big punch landed, and it sat him down. If he gets hit with another one of those, it might be good night, Irene. I'm not sure his opponent saw that coming. He didn't see it coming because he does such a great job of just throwing. He doesn't have any tell when he's going to throw a knee. All right, single collar tie now. 
And both fighters exchange in the pocket. job by him there to raise the guard DC and block those shots coming his way. He does a great job of blocking all incoming strikes. Drop clip with the right hand. Well, you can feel that breeze octagon side after the swing and a miss by the Korean Super Bowl. Big head kick. Tie. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Oh, and he connects there. Pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Well, not a great visual now. Two professional. Good shot there to land the takedown. Nice shot by Choi. Oh, nice job to reverse position on the ground. It was bad, but now it's not so bad. What a fantastic sweep. Three minutes now to go in this one. Well, hard to win fights in mixed martial arts from the bottom, but nice work here in that position by Chor. Oh, man. This ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not controlling his posture. He's allowing his opponent to get up, and when he does, it creates this space to land these beautiful ground and pound combinations. Strong bottom work here, staying busy. Back to the feet now. The Korean Superboy gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. Gotta shore up the defense here, though. Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now... Whoa! Goodness, what a fight. Pinpoint strike to end this fight. It landed flush. I'm not even sure the opponent only saw it coming. And before he could recover, the referee was in to stop the fight. So a huge knockout victory for that fighter here tonight. So a seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliata has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 47 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout, the Korean Super Bowl, Du Ho Chai. And there is the man of the moment, and what a moment this must be.